This panel offers us an interesting idea. Since black boxes and planes always survive the crash, why not just make the whole plane from the black boxes material? A sensational idea which unfortunately doesn't work. The flight recorder commonly known as the black box isn't really black, it's orange. Flight recorders are encased in layers of titanium and insulation to protect them from any impact or fire. Old flight recorders scratched lines into metal foil, but now they use stacked memory chips with no moving parts. Even if a flight recorder is shredded into small bits and put in salt water for months, the memory chips still hold information and can be pieced together by investigators. Most planes broadcast information via satellites, but black boxes are supposed to record the very last moments a plane crashes even after all signals are gone. But why don't they make the whole airplane out of the same materials black boxes are made of? Well, there are three main reasons why this isn't possible. Number one is weight. Airplanes are painted white because it is the lightest color. Imagine if its whole shell was replaced with super heavy titanium alloys. How many engines would be required to fly it? And how much energy would it need? Number two is the square cube law. Just because the black box is extremely resilient to crashes, this doesn't mean its upscaled version will also be. As shapes get bigger, volume increases by a cubic factor, while its cross-section area is squared. In simpler terms, something like ants can survive falls, but no way something bigger can do the same feat. Number 3. Resonance Even if we assume we had an alloy capable of making the whole airplane indestructible, that doesn't mean its contents will also be. Matter of fact, the force of the crash will resonate inside and transform whatever is in there into vegetables. This is the same reason why indestructible motorcycle helmets are a bad deal. A helmet will break and absorb energy, meaning it's taking the fall for you, but a tough one will just transmit the force into you to deal with it. 